Hello everyone, in this video we're going to look at the steps to create a local account on Windows 11. On Windows 11, a local account is also known as an offline account and it allows you to use your computer without a Microsoft account for a more private and secure experience. Usually it is recommended to set up your laptop or desktop with a Microsoft account since it offers more benefits like seamless integration with various services and file setting synchronization across devices. However, if you feel that a Cloud Power account type is not for you, it is possible to create a local account that doesn't connect to Microsoft services using the Settings app, Command Prompt, and PowerShell. So here are three ways to create a local account on Windows 11. First, let's look at the method to create a local account using the Settings app. And to do that, open Start and look for Settings, and then open the app then go to accounts, then click on family and other users, then click the add account button. Since we're creating a local account, we're going to click the I don't have this person's sign in information option. Then we're going to click the add a user without a Microsoft account option. And to create an account, first we need to specify a username. For example, test user two. Then we're going to create a password in order to be able to reset your password, in case you forget it, we need to set up some security questions. And this is a requirement. So we're just going to select a random question and make sure that you select the one that makes sense for you. Then click next. And that is all there is to it. That's how you create an account using the settings app. Now, when you create an account through this experience, you're going to be creating an account with the standard permissions. So it is not an administrator. So if you want to create an administrator that has full access to the computer, which sometimes depending who is using the computer, it's not recommended. But if you want to, you need to select the account and then on account options, you click the change account type and from here change the standard user to an administrator and then click OK. And then when you log off or log the computer or you can switch users right from this menu. You can now sign in with the new account. You can also use command prompt to create a local account on Windows 11. And you can also use the Windows Terminal depending on the application that you use. So in this case, I'm going to be using the Windows Terminal. So first, open Start and look for Terminal. And then right click the application and select the Run as an Administrator option. And then type this command, net user space and the name of the user account space and the password and the add option. This will create a standard account on Windows 11. If you want to, now, if you want to change the account type from a standard user to an administrator, you can use this command, net local group administrator, which is the group that you're going to be assigning to the test user three account, and then use the add option and then press enter. And if you want to double check that the account has been created, you can just simply open start and then we're going to see that we have the new account created. You can also use PowerShell to create an account on Windows 11. And to do that, you can use the PowerShell application or you can use a Windows Terminal. In this case, I'm just going to use the Windows Terminal. And to start, open the Start menu and look for the PowerShell app or the Windows Terminal. Right click the application and select the Run as administrator option then open a PowerShell session. To create an account, first we need to create a variable that will store the password for the account. And this is the command that you need to type. And in here, we're going to type the password. So now that we have a variable to store the password, we need to type the command to create the account. And this is the command to create a local account on Windows 11 with PowerShell. You need to use the net local user to specify the user account, the password, which grabs the variable from 
the command that we typed before and full name you can type the full name for the user and a description you can type anything you want but it have to be between quotes and then press enter so we just created a local account but right now it's a standard user account if you want to make an administrator you need to type this powershell command at local group member and then specify the for the groups administrator and for the member specify the account name and then press enter to double check that the account has been created simply open the start menu and then click the profile context menu and as you can see the account has been created and it's showing up right here because i specify the name for the user you're going to see the name instead of the user account name as you can see right here and that's it those are three ways that you can use to create a local account on windows 11 using settings command prompt and powershell remember to like the video leave your comments subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet and i just hope this video was informative for you and i would like to thank you for viewing